You're not going to believe this. These are some heavy duty, I think they're 4 mil or 3 mil uh, trash bags. And what I did is I heat sealed the end of it. with an iron and some uh, aluminum foil and then I heat sealed it all together and then I made a big enough end here so you can stick some um, juice cans grapefruit big grapefruit ju uh, grapefruit juice cans in there and I just blew it up with an electric hair dryer which was enough um, oomph to really get the thing going if you could get a hair dryer mower a motor without the um, without the heating core and figure out what kind of voltage you need you could uh, make this thing work let me just fire this up for a few seconds it's pretty much inflated hold on it's here spin this over here and let's see what we got here I think There you go. It's inflating up. Okay. The point of the matter is you could hang this out of a window in an apartment or your house or whatever and when the sun's shining on it um, blow air through one side and have it go all the way down to the bottom and come back up. And I think that you could actually heat seal aluminum foil on the inside on the back side so that a lot of that heat would reflect back in and not be lost through the back side of this um, this thing so here's the uh, let some of the heat out I'm um, pleased this is my first attempt what I would do in the future is um, connect all the tubes together and you have to do this on a, a board a real long board and then you got to scooch the stuff up at a time. You probably, um, so you're limited as to how long you can make these things. Um, but in any event, uh, I think it's worth uh, pursuing. I'm going to bring this back to Tawanda and uh, make a, a block in the window and connect this in there and get some fans so when the temperature comes up with the sun, it'll blow air through and see what kind of um, heat I get back into the house. It's cheap enough. And it'll probably last all winter. Anyhow, that's the deal. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye.